you. We'll see if Jonabel is wild. Are you wild? Well, for my partner, yes. I am willing to be wild, be more aggressive. Here again, everybody. So it's entertainment time, and I'm so happy to do this with Jonabel since she has so many entertainment videos. And for you, of course, you guys are curious what made her inspire those videos. But yeah, all right. So we'll see if Jonabel is wild. Are you wild? Well, for my partner, yes. I am willing to be wild, be more aggressive, and then um, be with a person who can give satisfaction towards my partner. <gasps> Satisfaction. I love that word. Okay, we'll see. We'll see. Mm, questions will follow. This is the entertainment video. Okay. So, who made you inspired to make those spicy topics? Oh, who make? Uh, who made me inspired oh, yeah. to make those? Inspired, yeah. Um. Actually, I think people should normalize that. That is not new. That talking about those things should not be like um, something different because it should be like the people should know and not be ignorant. Because what happened to the Philippines? Uh, there are when people said that um, uh, people should not discuss those kind of topic. Then it end up like a lot of us, a lot ignorant. of Filipina, ignorant. They get so pregnant. yeah. So that's why I'm trying at the same time trying to um, do awareness and at the same time for an entertainment and hopefully you guys doesn't you know <laughs> take that really seriously because we are just really so, having fun here do you receive some bad comments yes and trolls because of your topic video yes i do receive but i've learned that um um but I've learned to, you know, doesn't, you know, care about them because people will always have something to say, either good or bad actions that you are, you know, showing to them. They will still have judgment and we cannot please them. As what you have said, we cannot please everybody to like you. If they don't like you, then go. I mean, just, you know, as long as you are not hurting anybody, as long as you are not, yes. As long as you are not stepping someone's shoes, then that's really fine. Go what makes you happy. Go what makes you um, feel motivated to post that video. So, yeah. I see really nothing wrong with posting those spicy videos. Actually, there's more people making those and it's more... more yeah. It's like, just here. It's too much spice. Yeah. yeah. It's like, um, it's for entertainment. Just enjoy yeah. it. and uh -uh. Because, you know, they're thinking about, you know, you're single. And yeah. somebody told me, like, you're single and you're not allowed to do that. What are you going to say about it? I think all of us, um, this freedom to share what we, what our perspective is. Yeah, yeah. We all have a freedom to express what we want to share to other people. And that's why we are given a community that we are able to express what we want, yeah. what we want to create, what we want to share. Yeah. And that's it. We are, we are, you know, we have freedom to share those. Yeah, and I like it because you told me, you told me like it is all about also to help people here in the Philippines to be aware and not be ignorant. Yeah, because people are just, they are shy to talk about it, but they are more wild than yeah. us. <laughs> oh, they, wow. they got pregnant. Oh. They got pregnant early, yes. but they don't like to talk mm. about it. It's because they are ignorant. Yeah, they're ignorant and they don't have, they don't like to learn the yes. knowledge about it. So and this, the problem here is mostly when I read some comments, they are actually like dumb account. They yeah, are hiding, the and then account. they don't have the courage to face. And uh, their, you know, motive is to ruin your image or yeah, something. Yeah, yeah. But the purpose here, guys, is actually for an er entertainment. They want to provoke you, mm. especially when you are successful. They want to yes. drag you down and be sad, um, like depressed, and kill your channel. Yes, yeah. yes. <laughs> and they will be happy. Yes, they will be happy when you... <coughs> In a lower, yeah, lower position. They are very close minded. Yeah, close minded. They're not happy. Oh, that's only for the people, huh? Those only for the people. A disclaimer, guys. That's that's only for the people that make a bad comments towards the content that I make or the content that we make as a content creator. Um, so. 
But oh, let me add you like, but I do really love when um, even though that I receive you know bad comments or whatever mm -hmm. trolls and you know I can't understand them at all. But I do love uh, like majority of my subscriber really you know loves and support me, and then majority of them. So that means okay. It doesn't matter as long as I have the people that believe in me, yeah, yeah, then yeah. that's fine with me. Would you feel hurt when one of your members don't believe you anymore? One of my members members of YouTube? Yeah. Um, would I feel hurt? Maybe at first I would feel like I will be... Because you trusted them a lot and at the, uh, maybe in just one month they will hate you more and more and more and just hate you a lot. I will be hard, Jalai, to be honest, because I always um, put my subscriber as someone that I can, you know, cl I mean, very close. Mm -hmm. I mean, when I have a members, I really prioritize them. I treat them as my family. Mm -hmm. And the connection I have with my channel members or the subscriber that very close of mine yeah. is very different. And we are just like, you know, very close to each other. Of course, at first I would be hard, but... I am a person who is will accept the reality. If, like if a person doesn't like me, I will please for maybe first time, second time, third time, but I would not go beyond because if you don't want to accept or if you don't want example, I make mistake and I would say sorry and he, will, he, he is not interested to listen about my side or just he keep on <coughs> believing on the wrong one. So. Of course, um, I am a human as well. I get yeah, tired. Yeah. I have to let go, even if how close we are. I have to cut off the ties because that is toxic already. Yeah. If it drained me so much, I would let go that relationship. Yeah. So have you ever experienced that you get depressed on your channel? Like, what are the contents to make? <laughs> <laughs> Jolla, do you know that is really a good question? Because why is it? Making content is a very difficult. Yes, by searching, it's draining. <laughs> it's it's not draining. It's just making me hard. But I really love because when I make content, it makes me learn more, more, and more and more. And I'm really happy when I make content. I love it, and this at the same time, it's having me a hard time. But to be honest, I'm not depressed making content. What to do next? Because um, yeah. I just you know create content. What's in my mind, and then yeah. put it in notes, and then okay, I'll gather some ideas. Yeah. <laughs> I can tell that you're happy. <laughs> so if you're happy when you're doing, you don't feel like any depressing anymore. Yeah. yeah. So what would you, what would you choose? Either a spicy topic or a uh, story of life on your okay. channel. Ah, uh, if I were to choose. Yeah. Um. I guess I would divide my channel into two different <laughs> because I do believe that my viewers also have to know um, who am I mm -hmm. and they also have to know like it doesn't uh, they would say that oh it's not really their you know um, thing to know personal yeah. lives yeah. of the content creator but me as I just want to share because as what I have said I want to bond connection with my subscriber and maybe a little bit spicy because it if no spicy at all it would be a boring <laughs> <laughs> so city guy or province guy oh my god oh i would choose province guy why, why? because mostly if the it's really red flag for me jalai when they are in, living in the city and they go bar like almost of the time i don't yeah, really no. like those and then Actually, sit uh, whatever you came from, like city or province, I'm really fine with that. As long as you will love me, honey, that's really fine with me. <laughs> oh, I like it, I like it. So, honey. have you ever slept with stranger? No. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, so what is your biggest regret in life? The biggest regret in life is I don't believe that there are regrets in life. Though, people say that there are regret exist exist grab is exist so people that exist but for me it is part of the you know life past is past so past wanna know claro noon so past is past so i don't believe that 
those are be taken like seriously here in the present. Yeah, yeah, so yeah. what is the present? You should focus on that and not focus on the um, things in the past because regret will affect your present. Wow. And when you are not mentally healthy in your present, then it will affect day by day of your living. Wow, I like it. Yes. I like your answer. Alright, so what is the yummiest thing that you can't forget? Yummiest thing? All right, so I don't think if that is spicy or not, but since, uh, yeah, it, um, actually, <laughs> um, I have some, you know, I'm not really comfortable uh, answering that question, okay, but okay, okay, based on my understanding. <laughs> so, yeah, for me, um, I don't really have much experience when it comes to relationships, so you know, if you know what I mean. But the, the knowledge I really have is more about researching and being resourceful so that I can give knowledge or whatever. And then the yummiest thing would be like, <laughs> I don't know if I would answer if that is a person or the yummiest thing that I eat, <laughs> like foods. So yeah, that's it. I guess that is, that's it, Jalai. Okay. So next is what is your unforgettable moment with your partner or ex? That forgettable moments. Ja, um, for, uh, I only have one boyfriend before, and that was an LDR. So the unforgettable moment together was to um, talk, um, was to talk and then talk uh, deeper, uh, you know, live conversation, and then that is the most unforgettable moments for me. Oh wow. So what is the first experience that you will never forget? First experience. First experience, if I'm not mistaken about like first experience of yeah, yeah. something oh, like sure. bedroom, something. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> all right, so that's all everybody. And thank you so much for all your support. And thank you so much for also for you, Jonabel, because I know that you're busy in school, but you still have time to get here and meet me. Thank you so much. You so much. And have a great day, everyone. And don't forget to visit her channel. I will put the link on my, I put her link in my description below all right bye love you all